<laughs> I just whipped out a harp. Hey, a mini harp. Well, it's not the size of counts, Abigail. Just listen to me play. Hang on a sec. Oh, my aching back. It feels like I slept on some rocks and roots or something, but... Oh, wait a second. I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I passed out. Wilson! How did you get over there? You're like the magic dog. How'd you get outside? <laughs> Boy, come on in! And LG Futton! How did you get over here? Oh, something's weird. Some weird stuff going on here in this house. I think we're haunted. Yeah, I know. I see you. You're in the walls. Oh my gosh. Anyway, yeah, so I think I passed out last night. I fell asleep on the fl on the ground outside. Someone carried me in and put me in my bed. Maybe it was Wilson. I don't know. This is really strange. Anyway, sounds like it's raining out right now. It's going to be cloudy and windy tomorrow throughout the day. And we have uh, spirits in good humor today. Yay! We have a little extra luck. I hope so, because things aren't looking so good so far. My dog's stuck in the wall. Wilson! Oh, there you are. Then who the heck is this imposter in the house, Wilson? We've got a, a ghost dog or something. He's gone now. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe Wilson's having an out-of-body experience. That was really weird. Anyway, I love that it's raining. We don't have to do any watering today, so we have the whole day ahead of us. And look at all the goodies. Sunflowers, honey, mayonnaise, and mail. Let's check the mail first. Oh, it's from Linus, the old hermit who lives in a tent to the north. Punchwood, how are you doing? I've enclosed some instructions on how to make one of my favorite fish recipes, Linus. And it's sashimi! That's a fish recipe. Unfortunately, we can't make it because we don't have a kitchen. But I'm still going to make my way up there, maybe today, and, uh, and thank Linus personally. And he's also on the lookout for his berry basket, so maybe we can, uh, we can find that. Oh, more mail. Well, hold on. Yeah, let me check. Oh, yeah, blackberry basket right here. And it's not time, so we have plenty of time to look around for it. Although we do have to find a common mushroom for Sebastian today. That's only one day left. Ooh, okay. We'll do that today, hopefully. And let's check the mail. Another piece here, and it's from Dr. Harvey. Punchwood. Someone dropped you off at the clinic last night. You would passed down from exhaustion. You've got to take better care of yourself and go to bed at a reasonable hour. I billed you 992 gold to cover your medical expenses. I wonder why he's laughing. A thousand gold. Yeah, laughing all the way to the bank, Dr. Harvey. I'm going to get better insurance. Anyway, uh, another piece of mail here. That's three. Nice. It's from Mayor Lewis. Dear Punchwood, one week from today, we are holding the Stardew Valley in this town square. It's the biggest event of the year, drawing people from all across the country to our humble town. If you'd like, you can set up a grange display for the event. Just bring up to nine items that best showcase your talents. You'll be judged on the quality and diversity of your display. The fair starts at 9 a.m. Don't miss it, Mayor Lewis. <laughs> Why is everybody giggling when they write these letters? I can just imagine him, Mayor Lewis, giggling when he wrote down talents. Showcase my talents. Yeah, that's funny. Okay, let me, uh, well, let's grab this honey over here. We're not going to pluck the, um... I'm not going to pluck the sunflowers because I want the bees to get nectar from the sunflowers. I'm going to toss that in there. I'm not going to go to Pierre's today and sell it. So, uh, yeah, so I want to keep those around for now anyway. And do I have any... Oh, I do have some ores. Let's get some ores cooking up. Ooh, not you, fella. And then we're going to get organized and get started on our day. Oh, you know what? I got I to gotta go check on the chickens. As... Oh, my gosh. All right, let's go check the chickens because... La oh, my hat! Right. Uh, I guess Doc Harvey took it off so I'd be more comfortable when he tucked me into bed and charged me a ridiculous uh, copay. All right, let me just chuck all this in here for now. All right, gold star belly ice pit. Man, he was so hard to catch. We caught him in that little under underground um, pond in the mines, right? We'll chuck him in here. In fact, he'd probably make a, a wonderful entry in the Grange display, I think. So nine items, right? He'd be one, because he's pretty valuable, I think. Starfruit would be another. Doesn't have a golden star belly, but still it's worth um, quite a bit. So I think that would be um, a, a good addition. Melon, all of this. Yeah, so we've got plenty, plenty of items. That's perfect. Okay, let's grab the mayonnaise and go check on the chickens. Come on down here, Wilson. Oh, right. I left the door open because I passed out over here in the ground. Oh, man, they're going to be so upset. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Dilly. How you doing? You look fine today. Still have half a heart with her. And Dally, how you doing? Dally's looking good, too. Half a heart with both of the girls. All right, thanks, ladies. Jeez. Uh, well, maybe they have a short memory or they just don't hold a grudge. That's nice. All right, you guys stay inside, okay? It's really cruddy outside. Yeah, they'll just stay inside all day. There's food on their bench, so they'll be fine. What's up, bud? Come on down here. Uh, all right, so let me... Oh, wait, I gotta throw an egg in here. Just a little white egg in there. 
And I'm going to chuck these in here for now. Um, and how about the crops? Do we have any new crops? Oh, we do! Oh, oh, a scythe! They need a scythe for that. Where's my scythe? Where's my scythe? Over here in my new box. And you know what? I'm going to get rid of the crystal dagger. I don't really like it. I like my insect head better. Uh, Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man. Amaranth. Amaranth. Grab it. Golden star belly amaranth. Man, I'm getting good at this farming thing. And two silver star, star bellies and then two regulars. In fact, we have a mission here. Oh, yeah. Marnie wants to give her cows a special treat. She's asking for a single bunch of amaranth, amaranth. And we happen to have plenty of it. But my gosh, does she have any idea how much this stuff costs me? She's going to give it to cows? <laughs> you know how people get with their animals. They're crazy. They are crazy. I'm going to sell the silver and one gold and hang on to the two normals. Um, yeah, let's do that. I'm going to grab that right now. And let me go check my crab pots here. And then we will we'll get on with our day. Because I want to um, I want to go look for Linus's basket. That's the one thing I want to do. And we'll go deliver this amaranth, of course. And hold up. Corn! Oh, corn's are ready. Nice. So I have this cherry sapling cherry tree sapling right here it takes 28 days to mature to produce a cherry tree and it bears fruit in the spring so we need to get this guy in the ground like asap and it's got all well it's got the rest of fall and all winter to mature so in spring we'll get some cherries i bought this from pierre i want to get it in the ground now and i'm thinking right over here is a good spot i just have to clear away some trees make some space for it Right over here, and we'll get some wood too, so we can give that to um, give that to Robin the carpenter when we're ready to make that kitchen. So, all right, let me take down these couple of trees here, and then we'll get rolling. Hang tight. Timber. Awesome. All right, that's good enough. So my plan is to have a path come all the way down here, a path, a path, and have my fruit bearing trees right next to it here. And I want to have them going horizontally, so this will all be my orchard. And I'll have, like I said, maybe one of each. So I'm going to put it right here. And by the time it grows up, it'll probably pop up about here. I don't want it to block the... What? What was that? Something came up. Something just popped up. Oh! Oh! Oh, ma more mayo! Oh, that was fast! That mayo is so fast! Let's get some more grapes going. Uh, oh, wait, maybe we should make a blackberry. It's probably not as, as tasty as the... Uh, as the grape, but we're gonna grab it anyway. We're gonna make it anyway, I should say. So throw that in there, and I have one more egg, don't I? Yeah, two eggs today. All right, awesome. So I think we're ready to go. You know what? I'm gonna give this mayonnaise away. I'm gonna hang on to it. This is a really nice gift for somebody, and the jam as well. So maybe we'll give that away to somebody today. Let's get down. Ooh, can I cut through here? Yeah, I can with this thing, but not as that I don't get it like I do with the side. So let's head down south. Let's go visit Marnie, and then we'll uh, we'll look around for the blackberry basket and a mushroom. Oh, there's blackberries right here. Awesome, and a, a common mushroom for uh, what's his face, Sebastian. All right, here we go into Marnie's. Hello, Marnie. Oh, it's Jazz. Good morning, Jazz. How are you? What? <laughs> I said good morning. Hi. Yeah, okay. Good. Oh, it's afternoon. You're right. Anyway, hi, Marnie. I'm coming around. Just want to say hello. How are you? Hi, Punchwood. You look like you're soaked, you poor thing. Oh, I am. It's pouring rain, and I love it. I don't have to water the grubs today. Isn't it awesome? Hey, by the way, I got your thing for your cows. Here you go. Oh, the amaranth I asked for. Thank you so much. My cows are going to love this. Yeah, about that. Do you have any idea how much that cost me? But you know what? Hey, whatever. It's it's on, it's on you. Uh, you paid for it anyway, so... Wait, did she pay for it? Yeah, 500 gold. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that about covers it. I hope they enjoy. <laughs> That's real good stuff. Okay, and you know what? Let me just see what else we have here. Supply shop. A heater for the animals for the uh, for the winter. Awesome. A milk pail. Gather milk from cows. Shears to collect wool from sheep. No, I don't need any of that. And I have my own hay. But how about animals? Should I get a couple more chickens? Mm, you know what? I'm good. I'm good with two chickens. I'm good with two chickens. Oh, by the way, I want to give you some mayo. Here, have some mayonnaise. Thank you! No problem. I hope you enjoy. Spread it on that amaranth. Give it to the cows. Bye. All right. Let's go do some... Uh... Oh! <laughs> Harvesting! It's a common mushroom. It's a good one, too. Silver mushroom. Uh, I was going to go over to Leah's, but, you know, I don't really have time. 
I don't really have time to go visit her because I'll get stuck talking to her forever. So I really want to find this blackberry basket. Look at all the blackberries down here. It seems like a logical place to find a blackberry basket. Oh, another mushroom. Awesome. Let's grab that. Oh, golden star belly. Man, I'm getting really good at this harvesting thing. Ooh, lots of blackberry bushes over here by M. Rasmodius Wizard's place. Ooh, can I get that rock? All oh, right, I can get rocks out in the wild. Cool. I need rocks. I need lots of rocks. Oh, more blackberries. More common mushrooms. Awesome. I don't want to give Sebastian a golden star belly mushroom. I'll give him one of my my uh, common ones <laughs> if we get any. I guess I got that silver belly one, right? Man, there's tons of blackberries around here. Look at them all. But no sign of that um, that basket. So you know what? Let's just head back up north. Let's get up to Sebastian's and give him one of these mushrooms. So we can at least get that accomplished. All right, we're in town, and I think I'm going to stop off at the Star Drop Saloon. Hello, everybody. Farmer Punchwood here. It's a really rainy day out there. It's nice and dry inside. Just looking for Sebastian here in the game room, and he's not here. Okay, well, that's a stinker. So I guess we'll go check his house. I'll be back maybe later for a drink. We'll see you, Gus. Bye, Pam. Bye. Burp, burp, burp. Oh, hello. Shane, how we doing? Every time I try something new, it goes horribly wrong. You learn to just stay in a shell. No, 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 no. That's not the right attitude. Hold on. I'm going to give you something to make you feel better. You like berries, right? I think he likes berries. Hold on. Hold on. Here you go, buddy. This is great. Thanks. Anytime. Hey, Doc Harvey. About that 10% copay. Feel free to stop by my office if you're ever feeling ill. No. Stop changing the subject. I feel fine. Oh, there's Sebastian. You're young, though. You'll probably stay healthy without trying. Yeah, okay. Well, we'll see you later. If you find me on the ground again, just carry me in like last time. Hey, Sebastian, hold up, buddy. Pumpkin spice this, pumpkin spice that. Man, I do get sick of these seasonal fads. Pumpkin spice is delicious, but don't fret about it, my friend, because I got your mushroom right here. There you go. No pumpkin spice for for Farmer Punchwood. <laughs> hey, thanks for the help. This is just what I wanted. Wow, Sebastian showing emotion. And guess what? I can get into your room now. <laughs> we can play video games. All right, I'll be up later, baby. What's up, Alex? The beach is a cool place to hang out and soak up some rays. Uh, in case you haven't noticed, it's pouring rain, but uh, I know you're not the sharpest tool in the shed, but there he goes. All right, Sebastian, um, I I'll catch up to you later, okay? Maybe I'll drop by for a video game or two. I want to go catch a walleye, too. Yeah, walleye live in the lake up here, and I think all we need is um, one walleye to finish the lake fish bundle. I'm pretty... Oh, what's going on? Oh! <gasps> Abigail, play a flute thing. It's beautiful. Shh. I'm hiding in the bushes. Maybe I should come out of the bushes and show her that I'm here. I feel like a stalker. Yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. Let's go. <clears throat> Hi. <laughs> Punchwood, why are you out here in the rain? Is that a trick question, Abigail? <laughs> okay, she's trying to determine why I'm sneaking around in the bushes in the rain. So let's see. Just doing some work. Enjoying the weather. I could ask you the same question. You know what? I do love this weather. I'm enjoying the weather. Yeah, I guess you would be one to appreciate this somber ambiance. What are you trying to say? I came here to spend some time alone. Oh, of course you did. But I don't mind your company. You're getting soaked. Come stand under the tree. Okay, thanks. It's impossible to describe this feeling, watching the curtains of rain whisper above a silent lake. Oh, that's very poetic, Abigail. Have you ever tried poetry? Oh, check this out. I've got a harp. <laughs> I just whipped out a harp. Hey, a mini harp. Well, it's not the size that counts, Abigail. Just listen to me play. Hang on a sec. You're full of surprises, Punchwood. I'm impressed. Yeah, what do, what do you mean, mini harp? Here we go. Okay, let's play. It's beautiful. 
Wow. What a beautiful moment. Punchwood and Abigail making music under the tree in the rain. Beautiful music, I might add. Oh, where are we? Oh, okay. <laughs> We're here, Robins. Uh, let's go give something to Robin the carpenter if I can get in her house. How about blueberry jelly? Yeah, she appreciates pretty much anything. Although, wait, no, I should give, um... All right, yeah, let's just go in here real quick. Oh, she's not here. Okay, good. Oh, there's someone in the kitchen, but you know what? It's too far. I want to go see Linus and tell him... Oh, actually, you know what? I'm not going to go to Linus until I get his basket. I don't know where his basket is. Darn! All right, we'll tell you what. Let's go fish. Oh, is that a hazelnut? Yeah, I'm going to go fish. I want to try to catch this, um, this walleye. Let's see if there are any bubbles around first. I don't think I want to go to Linus's until I get his basket. So I'll have to keep looking around for it. It's going to turn up sooner or later. Oh, wait. Oh, I forgot this thing right here. Delivery. Yeah, 120 gold from Sebastian for that. Whoops. For the uh, for the mushroom. Back over 10,000. Nice. So while I can be caught in the lake, this is the mountain lake, in fall. Ooh, another treasure chest. Between... Um, uh, noon and 2 a.m. So we have plenty of time to catch this guy. Let's see. What do we got? Something better than wood. Coal! Not much better than wood. All right. Come on. Nine o'clock. And another treasure chest. Wow. The spirits are really doing awesome today. Spirits are super happy today, huh? That's the third treasure chest. And it's a... Ooh. What is that? A walleye! Wow, I got him, guys. He was pretty easy, actually. I got my bait back, too. <laughs> and the treasure chest. And the treasure's lousy. But that right there, in and of itself, is a treasure. So, you know what I'm going to do? I am actually going to go see Linus and just thank him for the sashimi recipe. Hey, Linus, are you home? Oh, Linus, you're home. Hi. Hey, thanks for that sashimi recipe. Um, I, I want to pay you back for that. So, I, how would you like some uh, some some jelly? This is a great gift, thank you! No problem! I hope you enjoy it. Spread it on some fish or something. Alright, we'll catch up to you later. By the way, I don't have your basket yet, but I'm on the lookout for it. As soon as I find it, you'll be the first to know. Alright, have a nice night. Bye! I love it inside a tent when it's raining. In real life and also in the game. Isn't that awesome? You hear the water dropping on the top of the tent. I love the drumming sound of the water on the top of the tent. I love the fact that you're inside this little tent, cozy and dry, as long as it's a good tent, <laughs> that is. Uh, yeah, I just love that whole that whole bit. Well, you know what? Let me check the cave today. Let me go in. 11 o'clock. I'm home on time today. Ooh, what's this? A wild plum, spice berry, and another wild three. Whoa, lots of wild plums. Um, oh, you know what? I wanted to go to the community center drop off the dang fish. Now it's too late. Oh, it's a sturgeon! A sturgeon for the lake fish bundle. My bad. It's the it's the night night fish bundle. Yeah, there it is. Okay, yeah, so we don't need to drop it off tonight because we still have to catch the eel. Okay, good, because that was a derp. Wasn't paying attention. Um, oh, we don't have to close the door because it's already closed. But we're home early. <gasps> Shh, Dilly Dally sleeping. Zzz. Zzz. I checked in on him. Everybody's good. Really nothing else to do today. Grab that mayo. And now, is there anything else? Oh, we'll sell these fish. Except the walleye. Do not sell that walleye or else. And I have so many blackberries, I'm just going to dump them all. Boom. Let's see what we get for that. All right. And now with that, my friends, it is time to get to bed. I don't have any more eggs, huh? No. All right, well, I'll have to wait for the morning for that. Let's uh, let's just put all this stuff away. And hop in bed before midnight. Hello, Wilson. I'm home early tonight. No copay. All right, let's see what we got here. Level up. Level six foraging. Nice. We got a plus one axe proficiency and a new crafting recipe, a lightning rod. Ooh, I wonder why we want to do that. We'll have to check that out tomorrow. We got wild seeds for fall recipe and another recipe a warp totem to the beach oh we can make those now because i ended up getting those as a reward i only had five of them but now we can craft them that's awesome all right well that's it for now let's see what we got 
So our bank for the day is 2,500 gold. Not too shabby. 1,140 for foraging. Sweet. Wow, that amaranth is worth quite a bit. 225 gold for a golden star belly amaranth. Very nice indeed. All right, that's it for now, guys. We'll see you in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Bye-bye. <laughs>